guys, I am here at the Big Buck World Championship with William Bromley. Now, my name is Thunder Explosion, but what we really care about is you. So what I need you to do for me first is give yourself a little bit of an introduction. Tell everybody where you're from and how long you've been playing Big Buck. Okay, so I'm from Sydney, Australia. I'm from a lovely area called Newtown. Um, I've been playing for quite a while now, since about 2004. So, yeah, it's quite a long time. Um, yeah. Thank you, everybody. I mean, that's a lot of time to put into this game. So, what exactly makes you want to play Big Buck? Is it because of the competition, love of the game? Is it for the money? Is it for the money, or just your, you know, friendship? It's for the, it's it's for the friendship. Yeah, I, I, we just get together with my mates and um, and just shoot it out, drink. Obviously, I work in bars, so uh, I've been around Buck for a long time, and you know. I just love it. I, yeah, it's for the for the love of it, basically, not for the money. The money helps, but uh, yeah. I mean, you mentioned that you work in bars. So, say that you were at a bar that didn't have a big buck machine. How exactly would you go about selling someone on a product like that? Uh, good question. Jeez, I uh, <laughs> I don't know. Um, I'd just say it's a lot of fun. It's very addictive. Uh, once you know, once you. Uh, once you shoot your first buck down, you 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 get hooked. Well, that's that's what happened with me. Um, and obviously, the rivalry between your friends is is a good, healthy uh, competition to have. Um, uh, yeah, I just yeah, love it. Okay. All right. Final question. Yeah. You've got a big day coming up for you tomorrow. I sure do. Yeah. What is your strategy going into your rounds of the Big Buck World Championship? An early night, not too much alcohol, so and definitely no shots. So I've, I've had a few beers just to take the edge off things. I didn't get to bed until five this morning, so uh, yeah, feeling a little dusty, but um, I'm ready. I'm gonna hopefully, you know, take out number one. Hopefully. <laughs> I mean, a little hair of the dog, and you should be fine. Yeah, yeah, just one or two more beers, and that's it, pretty much. I'll be in bed by midnight, definitely by midnight, if not beforehand. All right, well, that sounds like a great plan for me. Thank you so much for coming up here and talking with us. I really appreciate your time. We're going to send it back on over to the desk.